This is Jake Austin with Custom Wine Cellar Scottsdale and welcome to take a look at one of the most highly customized wine cellars we've created in the last few years. As you can see in this one, we have a steel structure. Uh, the steel structure is actually built by Maiden Steel. Dual pane thermal insulated glass, it's all weather stripped and sealed. We have some metal racking going down the middle with an LED backlit panel. We have some custom built steel wine storage here with some case storage and individual display. This is about a 300 bottle wine cellar. And as you can see, the aesthetics wasn't how many bottles we could get in it, but what we could make it look like. This one I've worked closely with an interior designer. Uh, we went through many lit levels. Uh, there's actually a lighting specialist that did the backlit panel. There's an interior designer I worked with, custom steel manufacturer that we worked with to complete the entire project, bring it together as a wine cellar. First conversation is going to find out what you need, right? What kind of space do you have? It's always best to, to provide your designer with what are you working with? If there's photographs, if there's measurements, are there windows, are there doors? You know, what are we working with from a, a measurement standpoint? And then two, have inspirational photographs. Makes it a lot easier. I can, you can send me a photograph, I'm gonna recognize who makes that rack, who manufactures it, where it came from, uh, just with the years of experience of doing this. And we can put something together that completely, custom, you know, completely fits your, your lifestyle, your collecting style, where you are and where you plan to go in the future. So customization options, you can see, you can go from all the way, uh, different sellers that we've looked at where they have vintage view, uh, metal racking, which is something that's a little more over the counter, versus something that's completely hand and custom design and takes time to develop and execute a plan. So you can have over the counter, you can have semi-custom to complete the magical custom. Like I said, this entire lower system is, is nothing that's available you know, over the counter. It was completely hand forged by a fabricator. We can work from ground up. We can work from a job that's already half done or just do racking. You know, if you can dream it, we can make it. So a big problem with that can be moisture and temperature. So if we're at a 55 degree room out here and you have an 80 degree day with some humidity, there's a chance for condensation. That's why we're very big on dual pane, thermal insulated glass, everything's weather stripped and sealed. Um, basically, we built a big refrigerator in there and we want to keep it at temperature. So we want to keep the moist, warm air out from the inside so it does not condensate on your glass or your steel. So now welcome to the laundry room. You saw in the wine cellar that you didn't see any mechanical equipment for the cooling system. What we did is we housed the RMD or the ducted RM coil from LRC in this housing that can be removed and accessed should the unit need to be serviced because obviously when somebody's doing laundry in here they don't want to listen to or look at a big piece of metal equipment so we hid it inside here and we did a supply and return duct into the wine cellar so it doesn't affect the visual of the entire space when you're going to build a wine cellar that is something like we were looking at we don't want to look at equipment. Let's face it, commercial grade cooling equipment is not made to be attractive. It's made to work <laughs> and to function properly and to have a room at a proper temperature. So hiding it behind here allows us to do one of two things. Keep it out of the way so nobody sees it, so it doesn't bother you from either the laundry room or looking at the wine cellar. And two, making something accessible should the equipment need to be serviced. I would recommend a service check every year. If you have your system checked every year, commercial grade system, they're gonna check pressure levels, they can check your valves, they can, they can check to see that everything's working properly. If you're running low on pressures, if they need to add refrigerant or not, I do recommend that you have everything serviced once a year. Like I said at the beginning, this wasn't about capacity, this was about what it, lo it looks like. So the lower rack in here is custom designed racking that I had made by Made in Steel, same people that made this door system. A door system with two side lights and it's actually a solid steel panel. These racks come from a lighting company, they're called MP183. They have a small light in each one of these racks, a small light at the top that also shadows down in each small section. They're all 750 milliliter size, so you couldn't really do large format in them, but you can take Chardonnays. Over here we have a couple of Pinot Noirs to go along with Syrah, Bordeaux style blends. So, you know, it kind of takes a little bit of everything. We had custom do pieces within this cellar, a custom steel beam that goes all the way across at one point here. 
And the same thing, there's a custom steel beam that goes all the way across where the light panel ends. So the, these racks themselves are actually welded to those steel beams. These sections can be opened individually. If you're worried about kids, we have locks on the bottom of each one of them. So each door opens independently so you can access everything within the space. This is a great prime example of what you have to look for in case storage. And this is why you would hire a designer to work with is that we're trained at vintage sellers to know sizes of different aspects, right? Most people are going to be buying wine when you see in these beautiful wood cases. Uh, they're known as original wood cases. You're looking at three packs, six packs, and 12 packs, right? So you have to understand what are the sizes of each one of those so you know how you want to lay out your wine. Where you could have a six pack like Harlan Estate, that's a double high six pack. Or you have a Spotswood six pack, that's a long, everything's on one single level, so it's a longer case. So other reasons why you'd want to incorporate using a designer to actually design yourself. Again, this is Jake. Yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for viewing some of our great work. I look forward to doing some design work for you as well.